Hey guys, this is SolarRack333 with another custom review. And here I have the Masters of the Universe Origins Stridor. And uh, this is mostly touch up, uh, not a full repaint, but I definitely wanted to add some details uh, to him. And it's pretty cool. Uh, basically, I just gave him a little bit of a black wash. Um, and then added some details to the mechanical bits like uh, silver, copper, and then some red, yellows, and blues. Some more copper. And then I gave it uh, some silver dry brushing. I also used some rub and buff. So a lot of the silver that you see like there and there, that's the rub and buff. But I guess with the rub and buff, you're going to have to apply a clear coat above it because it rubs off. It looks awesome though, uh, but I've seen a lot of customizers use it. Um, but I didn't realize that right after they would apply it, they definitely had a put like a clear coat to protect it um, so then I used a flat clear coat and then added some more dry brushing on top of that since it's flat thought it'd be neat to you know do that and then I also went ahead and painted the base Give it a flat black base coat and then dry brushed uh, various greens. I think I used the folk art green. That seems to be a good brand. Um, uh, I don't mind using it for stuff like this. I haven't really used it for like transformers to see if it uh, you know, flakes off during transformation. But the colors look good. Um, so yeah, if, if it's like static figures like these, where it's like a statue or just a display, I think the folk art paint is really good. Um, and then uh, used brown and then gave it a black wash. So yeah, it looks pretty cool. I like it. And then kind of big in my light tent here so here's a before and after I think what you're seeing is a clean plastic and here's the dirtied up plastic so there is a slight change in tone. I also think the, the flat clear coat kind of dulls it too. So this one has none of the details painted on. This one does. I'll also paint the helmet. This one looks really cool. And then the other one too. Again, gave it a black wash, then some silver dry brushing, and then a little bit of the rub and buff, and then the flat clear coat. And there's side one. I give him a 
both armors, both helmets. And then, one last comparison. Oh man, I fit down here. There's the classics. Stridor. This thing is huge. With the filmation. Uh, Fisto. There he is, Stridor. I should definitely invest in a larger light tent. There he is, and thanks for watching guys.